On the path of making money, nothing will benefit you as much as aligning your mind with the idea of wealth first. If you reprogram your mind for attracting money and wealth, then all the other steps become super easy. On my channel, I have always encouraged the viewers to take action towards their goal, and I don't preach sitting on your couch all day and expecting money to come to you, even though that is one of the ways people manifest wealth. Money can come to you even if you decide to do nothing, but it will be really difficult for you to hardwire your mind around this new idea. You have grown up in a world that has made you believe that everything happens as a cause and effect. So you do something or take an action, and as a result of that action, something shifts in your physical environment. Therefore, it's really difficult to give up that mindset for most people, and that's why I recommend working with what you already believe. And when I talk about taking action, it sure doesn't mean hustling day and night to get to the wealth you want. That's like forcing yourself to do something that you don't want to do, and it's never a good idea. What you need to do instead is to take inspired action. An inspired action is when you feel deeply motivated to do something from within. You take that action not because it will yield you some reward, the reward becomes secondary and the process becomes more important. This is the key to infinite money and riches that all the successful people in this world know about. They do what they love with all their heart and they passionately enjoy the process rather than worrying about the outcome. This relates to having a wealth mindset. When you run after money desperately, you are actually emphasizing the fact that you don't have enough to live your life. These emotions of lack become your assumption, and then you attract more situations that would confirm those emotions. This is how people stay stuck in the same emotions of lack for years and years on end, and they never attract any substantial amount of money in their lives. Then they go on to say that the concept of manifestation is a fraud, and that the law of assumption is just another theory. If you are trying to manifest money into your life, then I would like you to have a look at how you are approaching the subject of money. Do you have a robust wealth mindset in place that can help you on this journey, or are you still stuck in the limitations dictated to you by society? This moment of reflection is very important for you to know which way you have to go. If you feel like you don't have the right mindset, then let me share some practical tips that will help you in creating one. Once you create this mindset, I can guarantee a free flow of money into your life, because then you won't be looking at this subject from a place of lack and desperation. The first tip to create a money mindset and attract wealth is to look at the words you were speaking all day. The words you say every day definitely have a huge impact on how your mind thinks about a certain subject. So many people keep saying things like, I am worried about how I will afford that, or I don't have the money to buy that. We say these sentences every day to people around us, and sometimes to ourselves. Each time you say something like that, just like an affirmation it becomes repeated and eventually gets wired into your subconscious mind. This process of wiring a new belief is so subtle that you would never be able to notice it. So many people write to me that they have tried all the techniques and they are staying in the assumption of being wealthy, then why is money not showing up in their experience? Well, I will tell you. That happens because you are poisoning your mind with the words you were saying. You might think that you don't even mean what you say most times, then how can those words impact your mind? The answer is repetition. You repeat something enough times, and it will become a belief. That's just how the human mind works. This may sound absurd, but you can start saying anything. Anything that has absolutely no basis in reality still after a few weeks, it will become a belief of yours. Very few people pay attention to the words they say, and it's a pity because your language is reprogramming your mind. So, notice your language for a day or two and see what words you use for money and anything related to money. When you find yourself speaking something that might be negative, stop yourself from saying those words and change the conversation then and there. If you are vigilant about your language for just two days, you will gain a lot of insights into the words you say without even thinking. And once you are aware of those words, the next step is to eliminate them. This process is not so easy, but if you start using positive money affirmations, you will have less time saying negative things about money. Each one of you who is watching this video right now must have your own set of personal money affirmations. You can create them on your own, but there are a few conditions. Each positive affirmation must always be in the present tense. You shouldn't say, I will have the money. You have to say, I have the money now. The mind doesn't understand anything in the future. 
For your mind, everything has to happen in this present moment, in the now. So you have to tell your mind that what you desire is your present reality. Then you must change your money story. Each one of us has a story around every subject of our lives, and that includes money as well. I don't know you personally, but I can very well predict that your current money story is based on all the mishaps you had around money in the past. Maybe you were born into a poor household, or maybe you always had difficulty earning money. All those life experiences shape the story we tell about a certain subject. But being a manifester, you don't need to dwell in the past because we are concerned about creating the future here. To create an abundant and wealthy future for yourself, you must give up on the story of the past. Your past has no bearing on your future. Maybe you had a tough time with your finances in the past, but that doesn't mean you will have the same fate in the future. Your future is being created by the thoughts you are thinking right now. So, do you want it to be just like your past? I'm sure you wouldn't like that. That's why it is incredibly important that you let go of the past and create a new story. That new story will be created by thinking about and focusing on the wealth that is on its way to you. Your new money story can sound something like this. Money is my best friend and more and more money is coming into my experience every day. I love the fact that I can decide how much money I desire and just allow it to flow into my life because the universe is full of wealth and abundance. There is more than enough money to go around, and I know that I am now connected to the infinite source of wealth. I might have had problems with money in the past, but I let those memories and feelings go from my consciousness. I now open my mind to incredible wealth simply because I deserve it. Lastly, know that money is a feeling, and being rich is a feeling. And as a student of Neville and the Law of Assumption, you must know that a feeling is the starting point of all creation. If you want to be wealthy, you first have to embody the feeling of being rich. So ask yourself, what does being rich mean to me personally? What kind of life would I like to live being a rich and wealthy person? If you can write down your answers, that would be even better. Go into as much detail as you can and really explore your inner world. I want you to have an exact idea about how it feels to be rich. Daydream about your luxurious life whenever you can, visualize yourself going on the trips you always wanted, and see yourself enjoying all the blessings money can buy. When you do these little mental exercises, you will embody the feeling of wealth. And once you embody the feeling, the manifestation has to follow. That's the law. The next step in your successful manifestation journey is to keep watching my channel. Click now on the video on the screen to be inspired by another video.